Yo hello everyone and welcome back again to a brand new video. Embark on a smooth transition. Discover the intricacies of linking your Wix domain to your WordPress site. Preserve your online identity while unlocking the unparalleled flexibility and customization potential of WordPress. So guys, let's get started. So before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have the full information. So guys, we've been all in this position where we had a website, we built it, we built our uh, confidentially with clients, we have our reputation, we have everything, but we need to do something better. We need to upgrade our, for example, our work, our design, our stuff like that. But the website or the platform that we are currently using isn't supporting enough to help us achieve the goals and the vision that we are targeting at the moment. So what can we do? In this specific video, this is what I'm explaining exactly. What should you do and how can you transfer your Wix domain into your WordPress dashboard? So the first thing which is basically by owning a Wix domain in the first place. So Wix normally it is not really made for domains. It is basically a website builder. It has a page builder feature which is the key feature of Wix in general. It is basically drag and drop and this is what really uh, makes Wix a very very good uh, platform. But here if you want to any of these uh, website or only of my website that I have so simply you can here find the first thing that they are telling you is basically let me close that here we go so find your perfect domain and secure it in a few clicks so you can actually purchase now a domain name from Wix directly from this platform and you can directly after that connect it to your Wix dom website and start using it as your main uh, domain so first of all is how we can buy this domain name in the first place from Wix. Uh, maybe you want to buy it uh, because it is cheaper and then connect it to WordPress. This is an option, uh, but I'm not sure if it is cheaper or not because I know for sure for a fact that there is better uh, website uh, platform that actually gives a real big deals. But for now, simply all we're going to do is search for a website. Let's start, for example, with Titan LPD and then click on let's go and let's find okay we it is available so I can make it mine so now simply I'm just going to click on buy and now I am on this uh, Wix platform or Wix uh, page where I can simply buy this domain. I can choose here either I want to buy it for one year, two years or three years. Basically it is up to you to choose the amount of years that you want to pay for this specific domain name. So here as you can see I'm going to click on continue then you have to fulfill these informations and then the next thing to do is to simply put your privacy information which are basically um, your uh, billing address and finally of course your billing information from like which payment method are you going to use etc 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 so after that the uh, domain name will be yours and you can use it uh, here on Wix or as I'm going to show you now on other platforms as WordPress for example so the benefit of this video guys is that you are going to make a uh, development in your knowledge so this uh, actual tutorial can applicate applicated on every single platform not only Wix and WordPress so now let's say that you have put a domain name from Wix so the next thing is to go to our WordPress website here we go and here in WordPress as you can see they are going to give us here uh, the domain that we are currently using here it is so this is my domain name and now let's say I want to actually change it I want to actually have a domain name that I bought from Wix well this is the thing to actually change it all you have to do is to either go here to settings and actually add custom address as you can see here 
so you can uh, click here and then you can click here to add a new domain use a domain I own because and here you're gonna use the domain that you own you're not going to use any random domains because here they give you two options either to buy from their uh, marketplace a domain name uh, a brand new domain name from them so you're gonna buy it from them not from Wix and then connect it to them no it's gonna be directly from them uh, the prices here are pretty much cheap so $12 per year let's go here yeah pretty much cheaper than it seems and here also what's gonna happen is you don't need to actually do any redirection any process you just cannot buy it and it will be connected to, uh, like directly this is not what we want at all what we are going to do is use the domain that we own which is the one that we bought so simply you just have to copy this paste it here and normally uh, this domain name will not register because I didn't buy it yet but for example let's say for example that I have bought it and here we go so this is for example a domain so now we have two options the option number one is to transfer your domain so what you can do is to transfer your domain name from OX to your WordPress website how does it work basically they will uh, give you here this button which is select so you can simply go ahead and select it so for this setup we will need to log into your current domain provider and go through a few steps how long will it take it takes around 10 to 20 minutes to set up it can take up five days for the domain to be transferred depending on your provider so if you would like to have your domain point your wordpress.com site faster consider connecting your domain first so let's start the setup so here as you can see this is what you have to follow log in into your provider unlock the domain authorize the transfer and then finalize the transfer they are going to show you everything here one by one so you just have to unlock my domain and here they are actually going to detect it if it is locked or not so make sure to unlock it and then go to the authorize to the transfer and then finalize the transfer to make your domain transferred successfully this is as i said for the transfer domain but what we want is to keep it in the provider which is going to be wix and at the same time we want it to be connected to wordpress so here we're going to select the second option so here we go now in this specific option you have to get the premium version of wordpress so this is basically what you have to pay you have to fulfill everything and then you have to pay extra money which is gonna cost you a lot more than you would be uh, in general so make sure guys here let me just remove everything here we go so make sure guys that you really count your money if you have a limited budget well you can go for it if you don't well i really uh, like recommend that you go from wordpress buy a domain from wordpress or either you can even do is basically buy a domain from godaddy which is gonna cost you around one dollar for a dot com domain and then connect it to your wordpress website instead of going all the way around from Wix to wordpress and yeah guys that was it for today's video if you did enjoy this video make sure to leave a like and subscribe thank you guys a lot for watching and see you guys in the next tutorial